No, look who it is. It's the star of the show, the girlfriend. I'm only joking. That's me. I'm the star of the show, and I make up the rules. So here's today's update on the van. We've got some good news. I don't even need to go see the auto electrician because I have found this. And this is the light for the beacon on the van that I don't have. But in here, there's all my cigarettes. That's another story. Here is, I've got a fuse wire here. So all I need to do is pull that round there and run it into the boot. So, and because it's a business vehicle, I'm going to tell you that story. I need a sticker. Because you're not allowed to smoke in business, in vehicles for business. So I'm have a sticker just there that says, Strictly smoking only, enter at your own risk. And that's going to be my sign. It's going to be my sign, because that's me. Anyway, progress today, progress. We've got a, we've got a roof in. We've got a roof in here. Got a roof. Don't mind the gaps here. Don't worry about that. They're intentional. Because when I put the carpet on, it seals that. But this, on about that, this is the wire for the beacon. So I'm going to use this to wire all my lights. So I'm going to have four lights in here. That I'm going to cut out and then, put, and then I'm going to carpet it and put the lights in. I've also started building the wall. And south of the wall is going to be the generator. And north of the wall, there's going to be white walkers wearing headphones. I'm only joking. I'm only joking. It's going to be my water tank. But, so I made this frame and I've braced it with this because there's nothing straight or true or as you can see everything's curved nothing straight nothing level or anything so I've had to make a perfectly square frame and brace it in the corners and that's accurate to about a millimeter square and then I've had to ring me carpenter friend to help me and see what I need to do so I need to put these buttons on here and put one on here as well and this side's different again so we're using a long one and then we're going to put the braces in here take this off measure for this take this off screw it from this side two screws and then blast it from this side and then we'll have a support they will have, we'll have this wall supported then and obviously we can screw it in there when it comes round to it so we're halfway there to the wall so yeah yesterday was a bit of a bad day I went backwards, you can see here, I've pulled this out because I need the access for here. So this is going to change, but I've also decided I'm gonna fully carpet everything. Everything, everything, everything. I still need to put the insulation in on these, but it doesn't really matter because I've got plenty of time. So things are moving forward. And I'm a happy, happy boy. And I'm even happier because my girlfriend's just come back from shopping, been Primark and something for a meal, and she's brought me some beers. So I've done a little bit of filming on me, on me Sony. That's me A7 III. It's a little beast. So uh, we're starting to make progress here. So I'm hoping tomorrow I will have both the roofs in and the lights in position. I'll have the wall battened in and possibly, possibly might have the wall in. But I need to take everything back out to recap it, everything, etc. So we shall see. But I think I underestimated this job massively because I've had to change the plan with what I want to do with just because of attachment points. And now we're going to fix things. So I think I need another week. I think it's going to be a week. But when it's done, it'll be absolutely awesome. So, anyway, we've saved a fortune. We've saved 150 quid in auto electrician. Because that's probably what it'll cost. Uh, I've, I don't really know. I don't really know what to say. Because I, I, can't remember, I can't remember what I did yesterday. Nothing. Nothing much. I went backwards yesterday. I went backwards. Oh, also, you can see these panels are missing. These panels are missing. So... We're going to carpet them too. They're going to get carpeted. Everything's everything's going to get carpeted here. So that's going to be there. Obviously my tank's going to be just in here. And that's going to get fully enclosed. And also my huge sound system is going to go up against here. 5,000 watts by the way. 
I'll tell you something, there's no other better form of advertising than driving around with your music blasting every single person's going to see you. Every single person's going to see you. I and mean, if they think I'm a knobhead, that's fine. But they'll certainly remember me when my van's all sign written up and all smart and all logoed up. Everyone will know. Everyone. So there's no such thing as bad publicity. And another thing, I've also not done that much today because I've got rid of the other van. That has gone. So that's another good piece of news. So it's all good news at the moment. It's all good news. And I mean, good spirits. So this is going to be your update for today. I'm hoping tomorrow things move forward quite rapidly. So, yeah, I'll show you my wall here. You can see this is there. This is... This is perfectly straight here, square from the floor of the van, square from here, <coughs> upwards. So that's how you need to measure it because I can't measure it for level because I don't have level ground. And obviously I need power for my power tools for the jigsaw and the plane and circular saw and things like this. So yeah, that's pretty good. I'm, I'm moving forward. I'm moving forward eventually. So. I am going to get off and I'm going to leave you this for your daily update even though I didn't update yesterday because there was nothing to update because I pulled everything back out. So I will see you guys tomorrow. I don't know how much I'll get done because it's raining tomorrow but later on in the week it's starting to clear up so I'll be able to do some more work without getting soaked to the bone. So I'll catch you in a bit guys. Peace out.